Okay, here we are at the 2011 uh, Tailgate Show in Las Vegas, Nevada. And we're at Sporty K9, uh, our new line of pet products and apparel. And just the category in general uh, is very, very growing. This is a number that I've heard bantered about. It's hard to believe, but people in our country spend more money on their pets or right at the same amount as they do on their children. So it's a huge category, a lot of growth, and so far our experience in Sporty K9 has been excellent. Um, some of the best sellers for me have been dog bowls, collars, the bandanas, and Sharon from Sporty K9 will be here to kind of help us out a little bit. Uh, North Carolina, of course, uh, we've got North Carolina product in stock, uh, ready to go. Uh, South Carolina and Clemson merchandise is stock and ready to go. Um, and, and what other, if, if I was just doing looking at South Carolina, uh, can you give me just kind of a run through the line, Sharon? Sure. Yes. Uh, why don't we uh, look at North Carolina um, because we have the same products. Okay. We have, and I can take you over and show you the size runs in a minute. Sure. We have uh, the bandanas. The large bandana is frequently worn by girls and women. Right. Um, Madison Square Garden actually put them in their girls' section saying they were too nice for dogs. Uh, we have the caps, which come in three sizes. Okay. Uh, extremely adjustable with the Velcro side um, side pieces. Right. Um, this is our actual baseball, uh, excuse me, basketball jersey. Um, and we have <laughs> the side panels. Right. Um, and this is one of the most popular items is uh, the, the collars and the jerseys. Um, one thing to throw, I think, if anything, the uh, the hangers that you have actually really would help, help sell the line. No one else is going to have that. And presentation is everything, especially in our business. These can be bought for a dollar each right. to go ahead and help merchandise the product. And people usually only get two or three, and then they, they you know put up a display, and they usually do a front and a back. Right. Um, so they know it's not children's clothing. Yeah. It's frequently you know, mistake these. So. Yeah, I think that's a fantastic idea for the hangers, just so people don't misunderstand that that's children's clothing. Right. While I'm down here, this is the, uh, this is the varsity jacket. Right. The varsity jacket, the, the quality of the stitching in the sleeves, as well as the embroidery uh, on the back of it, is just fantastic. This is a very, very soft. Again, it actually feels like something you would want to buy for your child, uh, as it, uh, not uh, necessarily something you just want for your dog. But the right. quality is very, very people people-ish. Right, and the, the pleather actually feels like real leather. It's really soft, and um, we also have the pleather pockets. So a lot of people, it's really an impulse buy. Right. Um, well, up north, people buy it for the warmth of the dog, but, but right. people will buy it because it reminds them of what they wore in college or in high school. Uh, we also have some squeaky toys for... Um... Yeah, I heard it squeak. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah well, your dog will get it to squeak. Um, <laughs> Now, is it two different sizes of the collars? Uh, yes. Okay. And, and it also comes with a little charm on it? All my, all my collars come with the charms, which you can have your, your dog's name and uh, the telephone number engraved. So if your dog gets uh, right. at least have a phone number and where to call them. Um, and we continually are adding new schools all the time. Um, would you like to see the size run? Sure. Large dog owners don't expect. Now, this is going to be the Yankees. Right. But for the size runs, um, this fits. Uh, it's a 30, 36 inch girth, 35 inch girth, and it's like a large. Uh, like a lab or something yeah, like, like that? Yeah, like a large lab. And uh, most people's extra larges are maybe this long. In fact, you can take a look at this Yankee uh, dugout jacket. And so it's. it's it fits the big dogs. Mm -hmm. And so currently we have we have college, we have Major League Baseball, and uh, um, the NBA. NBA, but and not NFL. Soccer. And soccer, okay. Yeah. Uh, and so the caps come in three sizes. This is for the teacup dogs. Right. Uh, bandanas come in two. Right. And this is the size that girls and women wear. Um, yeah, one thing to point out here, this is actually a triangular cut. Uh, and not just a square bandana. Right, so, it's not square cut in half. It's actually engineered so that you get a 32 inches across the tie portion, right. but this, this doesn't go clear down your back. So um, you tend to, it's more expensive to make, but it looks so much better on the dog or the person. 
Um, the collars and leashes come in two sizes. I had offered to always do a medium, and buyers just don't want it because right. this goes from like a nine and a half to inch to fifteen. This goes uh, fifteen to twenty-eight right. inch neck. Matching leashes, they're six feet length. This is also a squeaky toy, right? No, this is actually. Yeah. Okay. Right. Uh, would you like to take a look at any of the uh, Major League Baseball teams, like the Braves? We'll just kind of flip through them here real quick. Uh, looking for, well, those are Red Sox down there. Right. We have, these are the dugout jackets. And these are dugout jackets again, right? Oops, sorry. All right. And they're lined with fleece. Uh, and then we also get uh, varsity jackets for some of the baseball teams. All right. So varsity jacket and dugout jackets. Okay. Right. And it's sort of hard to look at the... All right, the bowls. Let's take a look at those real quick. Okay. we've got. Uh, this is the large bowl down me. here, and that actually, this is probably a good description because we've got our nice puppy. Right. Uh, so two we'll different getting, sizes of bowls. Right. We'll be getting the placemats, uh, and the placemats are a little bit larger than what um, children would use, but mothers love that because right. the kid, when he's sloppy, there's less getting <laughs> food on the table. Right. And people tend to use the bowls for chips and salsa during uh, game parties. And I, I think that's almost the majority of the use. I'm wondering if dogs ever get them. <laughs> okay. Yeah, I like the bowl so much I'm not going to give it to my dog. Uh, right. They, I'm telling you, they use it. Um, and kids will eat cereal out of them, particularly right. in baseball. Yeah, it would be they a good cereal bowl. And, um, you know, they're dishwasher safe. Uh, you obviously never put hot food in plastic. Hi, guys. Say hello. Uh -huh. Yeah, we're filming. So now you'll be on our YouTube site. Oh, great. <laughs> oh, great. Well, let me go up and just show this display. The beds, the beds are... Right. Uh, the beds, this is a prototype. Um, okay. And we'll be coming out with this, and this will be uh, engraved. Uh, Embroidered? Embroidered. Yeah, not engraved. Embroidered. Right. Uh, so the dog uh, won't be able to grab it off. Right now, I've just put a, a Cubs logo on this one. Right. Um, but it's, what's really nice is it's a pillow bed, so mm -hmm. uh, you can use it if, even if you don't have a dog. Kids can use it in the dorm. Uh, you can use it in your family room. It's right. just a big, nice pillow. And dogs love them. How much will those probably retail for? Um, I believe they'll retail uh, in the high 40s. In the high 40s? Fifties. Okay. But that's, uh, then there's a smaller version of that. Uh, and then, of course, we have a football bed. Right. Let me swing over here real quick. All right, here's the football bed, and we've got some customers that have just come in, so we're going to go ahead and go, but again, this was 40K9 uh, with Holden Sales, and Sharon Kelly is the owner.